want to. Because... I don't know, I fucking love playing, playing Pokemon. And see, the question I... Or now the thing I have to do with every game that I want to play is... Okay, should I record it? Because if I play through it, and then if, like, even one person wants to see me play through it... What? Oh, odds are pretty good I'll play through it. So, I mean, I'm sure there's one person who might... Oh, shit! God, I did not know I could... That there's... Oh, God, this is... Shit! Okay, um... Fuck it. Fuck! Fuck! I'm getting pinned down! I'm a fucking idiot! Yeah, no, uh, if there's one per I'm sure at some point in the future there will be one person who would actually like to see me play, uh, Pokemon Fire Red. So, if I play through it, then if somebody wants to see me play through it in the future, then I'll have to play through it again. Okay, I won't have to. I will be... I will really want to play through it again. And I don't like playing get through games, like, multiple times in a row, one right after the other. So, if I, like, fuck, okay, if I'm gonna play a game, then I might as well be recording it, you know? The other problem is, how the fuck do I record that? There's no way I can record it on my, uh, Game Boy Advance. I... Game Boy Advance to SP. It's the little flip one. It's really cool, I love it. There's no way I can record it on that, so I'm gonna have to do it by an emulator online. Which is its own set of bullshit. Why is it shooting over there? I'm over here. Does it not understand that? Can I just do this all day and it won't care? Oh, nope, it cares. He cares. He cares. Uh... Yeah, let's... Oh, god. Wrong weapon. Ow. Alright, this should be it. I mean, come on. One more hit. Come on. There, that's it. Sweet. No, so yeah, I will be playing through it eventually. Captain Cork. First, you made another miraculous comeback. Who the fuck? Why the fuck now is this bitch here now? The Tyranoids in a spectacular battle on their own planet. How do you explain your recent success? Courage, compassion, dashing good look. Being a cock sucker. Seriously, though, to be a true hero of heroes, you need more than loads of charisma and a brilliant tactical. <laughs> and he's a woman beater. I couldn't have done it without. The These monkey. Massive guns. Oh. Mwah, mwah. Glad to see you made it through in one piece, Ratchet. You must have quite a story to tell. <laughs> yeah, so I okay, wait, so Um Do we have to do this stuff is what I'm wondering. I'm pretty sure we have to. But it's not like, oh god, do we have to do these? It's like, okay, are these optional, or do I... To progress the game, which I'm fine with either one. I'm going to be doing them. <sighs> okay, ejects portable shields that can be used as cover or to block enemies. The hollow shields can only absorb... That could be useful. But I'd be spending... I'd be left with like 53,000, I think. But I'm sure I could get it back pretty easily. Or would I be left with 57,000? I don't fucking know. My math is horrible. What's 87 minus 24? All right, so eighty, so eighty-seven minus twenty-seven would be sixty. So then sixty minus three would be fifty-seven. So I'd be left with fifty-seven, fifty-seven thousand volts, and I'm sure I could get three thousand in no time. And but the question is, like mobile shields, that would really only be good against boss fights where you're stuck in one arena because this game is, you know, you're not stuck in one place; you're running through. So, nah, not worth it. I would want to spend money on, like, something like this. But then again, how often do you fight enemies at long range? Like, how often do you need to? Like, not that often. So I'm going to save up for armor and other guns. Glad to see you made it through him. Yep. Wait, why? Okay, yeah. Wait, okay, so she said go come back to the Phoenix. So I think this is optional. But I'm still going to do it because, you know, it's pretty cool. Like little assaults. I like salt. I'm actually not the biggest fan. Like, my dad used to put uh, salt and pepper in my eggs when he made me breakfast. And I actually haven't had salt and pepper in my eggs in a really long time. And now that I'm talking about. 
So, right, welcome to the food playthrough, uh, where I talk about uh, bacon bits and my uh, baked potato and steak with baked potato and eggs with salt and pepper. I actually am really specific about my food. I There are certain foods I hate, and of course I'll tell you what they are because, you know, I want you guys to have, you know, watch my video, you like what you see so far, and then you hear me say that I really hate milk, I really fucking hate cheese, I hate tomatoes, and now you guys are like, okay, well, no way I'm stopping to this asshole. Alright. Yeah, no, if you think I'm joking, I fucking detest cheese of any kind. Well, okay, no, a few exceptions. Uh, cheese pizza, love it. Uh, mac and cheese, love it. Uh, what else? Pretty much it, like, I, okay, all the types of cheese I hate. I hate cheeseburgers. Cannot stand. I love I love hamburgers. Don't get me wrong. I love hamburgers, but cheese on a hamburger to me is just antithetical to what a good burger is. And if you can't tell that I'm being sarcastic, like you can enjoy whatever the fuck you want on your food. I don't care about that. But you try to put cheese on my burger, I will slap you. And yes, for the record, uh, every fucking time I go to like I don't know Red Robin or. Any of that shit. And they put cheese on my fucking burger. I have to send it back. And I always feel like such a dick. Because they're like... Wait, I'm sorry. You don't want cheese? Why not? Holy shit. This thing can attack like, what, five now? That's pretty cool. Alright, I'm destroying this before it kills me. And I realize in trying to destroy it, I just lost quite a bit of health. Oh, God. Sweet Jesus. I just see the map just light up. That sounds good. You guys do that, I will uh, destroy these fuckers. Oh god. What is health? Not something I have. Yeah, no, I'm really picky about my food. I don't like milk of any kind, by the way. Uh, fun fact though, I love ice cream. Fucking love ice cream. Favorite flavor? Um, a few ones. I love rainbow sherbet. Uh, I love cotton candy from Cold Stone. Like rainbow sherbet from Baskin's Baskin Robbins, and cotton candy from uh, Cold Stone Creamery. Not the gun I wanted to use, but I guess it's the gun I am gonna use. What is this music? It's really loud. I might have to turn that down. In uh, editing. In post. Whatever you call it. I don't know. Something I should actually do before I record is record a little bit and test different sounds and stuff. The problem is that would, you know, require effort and fuck that. No, I'm, I'm kidding. Uh, it's something that I think about mid-recording and I tell myself that next recording session I'm going to do, but I just forget. Like, if you think this is me being lazy, no, it's me dying. Fuck! I have to do all that again? Oh my god. I'm gonna do it one more time. Oh shit, I'm already here? Oh, well then, sweet, yeah. I don't have to redo that opening. No, uh... I'm very, I'm very particular about my food. I'm what you call a fussy, picky eater. Or, as the rest of the world calls it, pain in the ass. I mean, honestly, the amount of times I've had to send food back because it had cheese on it, like... I, you could feed fucking Africa with the amount of food I sent back because it had cheese on it. And yes, of course I'm exaggerating, but not by a considerable amount. Yes, I have to do all the work because you fucks are lazy and won't destroy the things that have taken out half my health. Oh my god. Fuck! Okay. Covering fire! Do I have to destroy these fucking things? Oh shit, oh fuck, oh shit, fuck. Seriously, what the fuck? Can you guys not destroy them? Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm out. I refuse. Disengaging. I don't care if you if it's optional or if it's mandatory, I'm not doing it in this recording session. Because I've been recording for two hours and fifty-eight minutes now. I'm done. This is the second longest recording session I've ever done, and actually it went pretty well, I think. I don't know, I got a lot done. 
Fucking love Up Your Arsenal. It's such a good game. God, all the Ratchet and Clank games are, with three exceptions. But we don't we don't talk about those. Glad to see you made it through in one piece, Ratchet. You must have quite a story to tell. Why don't you come back to the Phoenix and fill us in? I'll fill you in. Haha. <laughs> All right, well, that will wrap it up for us uh, in this session. Yes, yeah, so we'll go into the Phoenix. Uh, if you liked what you saw and heard, I would really appreciate a comment telling me what you liked. Uh, it really helps. Uh, you don't have to leave a like, you don't have to leave, uh, you don't have to subscribe if you don't want to, but really, even if you're just passing through and you're just watching this for whatever reason, I would really appreciate it. Just a, I don't know, a 10 word comment just saying, I don't know, Games music too loud. That tells me that okay, the game's music was too loud. I mean, I obviously listen to everything, and I in editing I watch it before I upload it. But I don't know. Sometimes I make it was a mistake. The biggest tyrannoid you've ever seen. <laughs> Big as a star cruiser and packing twice as much firepower. There was no escape. He was coming right at me. Closer, closer. Oh, what am I gonna do? Right, closer.